of challenge with this challenge we're going to be doing flag in a flame which is a forensic challenge by pico ctf so it says the sock discovered a suspiciously large large file after a recent breach where they opened it they found an enormous block of encoded text instead of typical logs could there be something hidden within your mission is to inspect the resulting file and reveal the purpose of it the team is relying on our skills to uncover any concealed information with this unusual log it says download the encoded data here, logs data, and be prepared. The file is large and examine it through the crucial. Use base64 to decode the file and generate the image file. So that's basically the hint. So basically, I already downloaded the logs in logs.txt. And as you see below, it's just basically base64 data. So they literally tell us what to do. So you want to be able to turn this logs, decode it, base64, and then convert it to an image file. So we could do that pretty simple right here, which I already did in the previous i guess challenge so we wanted to be able to do is first cat the logs and after that pipe that data so it gets base 64 decoded and then that data gets outputted to hello.jpg so i'll keep even break this down even more so uh, right now i generated the logs but i'll tell you what i did right now so we're gonna do cat logs.txt which is basically gonna output everything then the next step will be just to base 64 decode everything but it's gibberish which is basically part of the image file so that's why it's generating this type of stuff now within that all we simply do is get all that data and then put it into a file called hello.jpg and that's basically how we generate our answer so if you look at finder and look at hello.jpg that we generated, we get this cool hacker. So we know that we're onto something and we get data right here. So what do we need to do with this challenge? So we know we have this data right here. So what we can do is basically just grab this data located right here. We'll just close this. Close this and then go right here. Hello.jpg. And then... See if we could grab this data right here. Yeah, see, look, since I'm on Mac, Mac has that ability to be able to, like, except for me typing it one by one, I could just grab something and paste it. So I already have it copied, pasted all the numbers right here, and now right here is just basically a guessing game what this is. But we could guess it's base 64. So from base 64, we get a bunch of gibberish. So that's not it. So we could keep on guessing these popular ones. The next one I got was from Hex, which kind of matches what we have right here, which is just numbers and letters all jumbled up together. So we do from Hex, we get the flag. Pico CTF forensic analysis is amazing. So we just copy this and then input it right here. And that should solve us this challenge, which makes it pretty fun. So we do this and we solve the challenge. So yeah, that's about it for this video. Hope you guys learned something new today. I know I did. And yep. Yeah. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.